what to expect from the Summer 16 tour. I mean, come on now. You're bringing out the heavy hitters. Like This might be the tour of the summer. And I understand there's other tours going on. You know, you got Wiz and um, Snoop Dogg going on tour with Kevin Gates and Janae Akko. That might be a good tour. But I think Summer 16 tour has a it makes it being legendary because, I mean, you can't find someone that's not a, either a Drake fan or a Future fan or probably both. You're not going to find too many people that are not fans of one of the two. You know, you got the, the leader of the trap in Future and the leader of the, the sentimental side in Drake. And you got them two who've already done music, got an album together, and they got a couple records on each other's albums together. It looked like Future's probably going to drop one more mixtape before the tour. He just went on tour with, with Ty Dolla Sign, meaning that he's already visited these cities and performed that music. He's going to have to put out some new music. I'm pretty sure Future has no problems putting out new music. So I think that Summer 16 tour could be legendary. They got four stops in New York. Four stops in New York. That's saying something. Not a lot of artists can sell out four times. I'm not sure if they sold out yet, but four stops in New York is big. Two stops in Atlanta. The only thing I'm concerned about is oversaturating those cities. Maybe you could have spread that out. I'm pretty sure Future and Drake can sell out anywhere they want to go. Maybe you could have spread that out a little bit more. I think the tour is going to be amazing. The guests that they're going to have on the tour is probably going to be incredible. You're pretty, I'm pretty sure you're going to see Wayne in New Orleans. I'm pretty sure you're going to see other artists you know, from Future's side that he's worked with. You know, Future's done features for pretty much anybody, so every artist can say they work with Future. I'm pretty sure this album is going to be legendary, the Summer 16 tour. And for Drake and Future to sign on after they had problems in the past and for them to you know, reconcile their differences and, and do this tour together, while both of them are on top of their games, it's huge for the culture. And I think all Summer 16, Drake and Future are going to give you hell. I'm pretty sure this will be the top tour of the summer. And it'll go all, in, I think, through September maybe, even touching October. It's going to be a... Pretty lengthy tour. Drake and Future, you gotta know it's gonna be legendary. I can just imagine some of the guests that's gonna be on this tour. It's just, you know, it's gonna be crazy, man. I'm very excited. I think I'm going to one of the Atlanta stops. And salute these two for going on tour together. I'm hearing that a lot of locations are already sold out. I know it's gonna be a big one. You don't take, don't take these moments for granted that you got Drake and Future on the same tour on top of their games. This is like Kobe and LeBron meeting in the finals. We never got that, you know, on both at the top of their careers. So don't take this for granted, man. It's a, you hey, know, I big want to thank you for taking time out of your day to watch my interview, my performance, or maybe it was a feature story. Now, right now, you can either subscribe to my channel or you can watch other performances. Thank you for taking the time out. It's MrTelleferro.com. A way to talk to everybody, like to let them know that I'm okay, or I'm, I'm this, I'm that. Like, it's saying hi to the world, for real, for real. Like, I'm not lying, I'm not playing, like, because you know how many, you know.